Are you ready to look 10 years younger this fall? Well, let's shave off the years and dive right in. Hello, fashionista. I'm Nancy Queen, and I'm here to help you build a wardrobe full of clothes you love to wear so you love getting dressed every single day. And today we are talking about how to shave off some years just by changing up the clothes that we wear. So if you're a woman over 50, you may feel like, gosh, I wish I could look a little bit younger, turn back the clock. I'm not saying that you need Botox or facelift or anything, but just by making some changes to our wardrobe and our what we're wearing this fall, we can look five, 10, 15 years younger. So let's get into my best tips that you'll want to start right now. Number one on my list is show some wrist. So as you can see here, my sleeves are all the way down. Well, it just kind of covers me up. You, Your eye goes to this weighty part, just kind of drags you down and gives you an older look. But if you just pull up those sleeves a little bit, now these have elastic, but you pull those up, what it's doing is showing off the skinniest part of your body, your wrist. And even a little bracelet here or there draws your eye to that skinny part. That's why we're wearing the bracelet to draw your eye there and it just gives you a more youthful look, lightens you up, and it's an easy way to make you look younger. Now, if you want to do a blouse and you're folding up the sleeves, I did a video here on button down shirts and I show you how to roll up the sleeves on a button down shirt so they stay put. It'll show off your wrists and give you a great look. Tip number two on my list is avoid boxy silhouettes. Now, if you look at this shirt here, now I don't know if you can see it in this, but it's pretty squared off. And if I just wear it like this, it gives me a boxy look here, boxy look here, and it just kind of makes me look frumpy. But what you need to do is create some angles in your body. So you just give it a little tuck it doesn't have to be, even if you have a tummy, you can do this because what it's gonna do is it's gonna draw your eye to angles. I'm not saying tuck in your whole shirt. You're still gonna leave a lot down so that it's blousey, but you're just gonna do a slight tuck and it's gonna draw your eye to this angle that you've created. You're not looking as wide in the middle and it's creating angles in your body, which gives you a more youthful look. Tip number three, another way to create angles in the body at, and avoid that boxy look is to wear asymmetrical pieces or wrap dresses or dresses that draw your eye to the side. That is a great way to just, it's that optical illusion that creates these interesting angles in your body and makes you look youthful, slimmer, and just more on trend and up to date. Number four on my list is mix edgy pieces with classic pieces. Now I have a good example for you. I recently did a video on wearing leopard print and I think leopard print is a good example of edgy and it doesn't have to be like pattern or a woven texture, just something that is unexpected, that's modern and fresh and then wear it with your more classic pieces and it will allow that piece to be the star of the show and it just adds a an updated look and feel to your wardrobe by mixing something that's unexpected and edgier more on trend with something classic there's so many different ways to go that i could talk about this subject all day maybe that's another whole video in itself if you like that topic, let me know in the description below and I'll make a video on that. Number five on my list of ways to look younger is choose colors that flatter your face. Now, in a recent video I did also on how to look 10 years younger, I talked about not wearing black because black weighs us down. It's very harsh. It shows wrinkles. It shows the dark circles. So we want to avoid black and go for brighter colors. Even this um, navy is not so harsh against the skin. You get a little bit of reflection to it. It's easier to wear. It's my go-to now. I really love wearing that because it just kind of brightens me up more. In addition, if you've seen any of my other 
videos, you know that I absolutely love wearing color, especially pink. I can't seem to get enough of nice, bright colors. And the reason why is they make me feel good when I put them on. I get lots of compliments when I wear those colors. And I know that my face looks lighter and brighter when I wear them. So find colors that you like. You can even think of what are colors you've worn that you've gotten lots of compliments on. Those might be the colors that you should go to. And if you're, you know, not everybody does color analysis. Have you if you've seen color analysis? They hold up different colors against your face and see which uh, color is better for you. But you want things that are lighter and brighter and really are going to brighten up your face and make you look years younger. Number six on my list has to do with wearing pastels. Now, as you can see, I'm not a big pastel person, but when I do wear pastels, I always anchor them with darker pieces. And the reason why is because it, wearing all pastels kind of makes you think of those old lady suits, those Sunday church suits where they dress head to toe in all one color. And if you want to look more youthful and more together, you can still wear those pastels because those pastels are probably going to look really nice against your skin. Wear them up here, but then pair it with a pair of darker jeans or darker shorts, and then anchor that with darker accessories. Uh, it will give you a more modern updated look by wearing pastels with darker neutrals. Number seven on my list of ways to look younger is mix up textures. As you can see here with my jewelry, this is a great example. I've got on four different bracelets and none of them are the same. They all are different textures and different, little bit different designs. I've got a chain link. This one's a chain link with little sparkly diamonds. This one is beads with a little leaf and rhinestone. This one are bigger beads with a rhinestone. So I'm changing things up, adding texture and interest to my wardrobe by mixing up the textures that you see. And you can do the same thing with your clothes. There's so many ways that you can mix and match textures. You could wear a wool blazer with a pair of jeans. That's a great contrast in texture. Tip number eight I have for you to shave off the years is switch out your jersey knit bottoms for Ponte. Now Ponte is a much thicker knit. It still has stretch to it, but it's thicker and it's going to smooth things out. That's why you see so many pants done in this fabric. As much as I love wearing knitted pants around the house because they are super, super comfortable. I mean, all of my PJs are, are just your typical cotton knit that I am so comfortable in. When you go out of the house, they are going to show every lump and bump that you have. So switch those out to Ponte fabric pant and even skirts. It'll give you a much smoother line. It evens everything out. It just looks more youthful, more pulled together, and you will feel so much more confident in it because of the look that it provides. Tip number nine I have for you is update your denim. This is one of the biggest ways that I think women our age tend to look older is that we're wearing jeans that we've been wearing for 20, 30 years and we're like, well, they're still good, so I'll just keep wearing them. Well, it's not the case. If you want to update your look and stay fresh and look a lot younger, update your denim. Now, it doesn't mean you have to go super baggy or be on the latest crazy trend, but you can go and find updated denim that is going to be in the know and it will give you a much more updated look. In fact, I just did one video recently here where I talk about the updated trends on denim and they're a looser leg, they're not low rise, they're higher waisted and they are going to give you just a more refreshed, refined look and shave off those years. And tip number 10 I have for you in dressing younger, 10 years younger for fall, is just have fun with it all. This is fashion. We're here to have fun, enjoy ourselves, use it to express yourself, enjoy what you're wearing, and I will see you in the next video.